inspecting our pellets so they can see the food chain in action and they can also see adaptations that barn owls have. And they collect them and they really cool. An owl will eat something, and if it can't swallow it, like if it's too big, it, it has to get it out, digest, digest it out of its mouth before it can eat something else. And we're opening an owl pellet right now. This is so gross. There might be a skull inside. I don't know what that is. I just found something like. I just found something crunchy. Crunchy? I feel like everything's I think crunchy in here. I think that's part of the tooth. Do you have a Look at this, Mia. I think it's part of the tooth. Oh. That is looking like a skull. See the spots right up here where your finger is? That's where the eyes would have been. Then there's that. You can't see mm -hmm. it. It's cool. And it's fun to do. Hey! Oh! Is that this bowl? We found, found some bottom jaws, we found some skulls, we found some pelvic bones, we found some lips, we found some other bones that I have no idea what they are. And yes, there's a lot. We found three skulls. So here's one of the skulls. Others. I actually want to do my finger. Wait, would okay, I have any limbs? This is the skull. I think it's a mouse. So, <laughs> and these are the two jaws that are supposed to be attached to it. And yeah, I think this is the limb part. So that's pretty cool. I found a jawline like this and lots of other kinds of bones. This little jawline. We found a lot of bones. We think we found like a mouse or something like that. I found one skull. It's a mole. So did I. And Owen found one skull, which is a mole. I found a couple jaw bones which are supposed to be attached together. I also have a few limbs. What's the best? Your mom is the jaw, um, the skull, the, um, some nails, and a beak. So we found two skulls. I don't think they would be called skulls. I think they would be more like uh, jaws. Half of skull? Jaws. Okay, jaws. And we found a few bones, and vertebrate teeth, and lots of teeth. It's a shrew's jaw, from what the chart says. Because it has that one there. I think it's an omnivore because it has that really sharp tooth, and then it has these um, other teeth in the back to like eat all the vegetables. I think this is cool. I thought I was just seeing.